Alright, hello and welcome everybody. It is Pox again. So today I'm coming to you guys with some PoE content as it's been highly requested from the comments I've been reading on Grimdon. So this is going to be a character I'm going to be taking a little bit slow uh, while we're playing. Uh, just as a reminder, I do play Path of Exile in Hardcore and Grimdon not in Hardcore, so just something to know for you guys. So this is going to be a crit uh, assassin as of right now. There's a couple of sanities you can play between. Um, Pure Fire Bear Trapper with Blade Fall because it scales as Fizz 2. So the ideal goal is using Signal Fire along with a currently Zoff's Inception, but we will have Zoff's Nurture later on. And Zoff's Nurture is good because it gives us the ability to spread kind of like Prolif. If you guys ever saw my Beano's Poison Blade Fall Trapper, this is going to be similar to that character but themed around fire. Um, so those are kind of going to be some of the two core items. Of course, you can do absolutely whatever you'd like, but this is what I've got set up right now. I did get an Ash Rend. Now, I know this is six link. You do not need to use a six link Ash Rend. Uh, I didn't mean to six link it. I wanted to five link it, but it just so happened to six link. There are a couple options you can use for chess pieces. There's Combs Heart. There's Tinker Skin. There's actually Ash Rend if you want. It does give life and an extra link. Um, but ideally, I want to use Cloak of Defiance because that's kind of the way our build is themed around. Uh, if you guys kind of want to see what it looks like right now, um, here you go. Remember that you do not want to pick up Spell Crit because that does not work for your uh, Bear Trap. You need Global Crit and like Power Charges, which is part of the reason why we're going Assassin. Um, so currently with our tree right now, we are on our way to Acrobatics, and then we have to pick up like Heart Seeker, Herbalism, uh, Revenge of the Hunted and then like potentially Master Sapper. In terms of our links, I wanna go over really quickly right now. Um, this is Bladefall in our Deerstalker, so it's got trap already. So it's trap, fizz to lightning, multiple traps, added fire, and Bladefall. The reason why I've got fizz to lightning is this converts it full elemental, which allows me to scale with the elemental damage nodes better. When I do get my new bow, you won't need fizz to lightning because you'll have pure fire conversion. Right now we just have 50% from our signal fire. Um, in terms of our bear trap currently, we have Empower level 2, which is only like 15 chaos. Elemental focus, bear trap, increased critical strikes, trap and mind damage, fizz to lightning. Ideally, we'll replace fizz to lightning and elemental focus. Uh, I don't remember the exact links I was going to use. You can have like crit damage, you can have fire pen, uh, you can even use like chance to ignite, and you can use a couple other ones too to really mess around with what you'd like. Other than that, I don't really have anything special. Um, so the reason why I decided to make this video is because with Bear Trap, you chunk bosses really, really hard. And sometimes you chunk a boss so hard on the initial part of the phase that it actually can glitch the boss because bosses have, have phases. And normally when you hit a target, you hit it really fast. So it goes through its phase and it resets. But with Bear Trap, Bear Trap like actually like cuts it and glitches it. So we've been having a little bit of uh, some awkward issues here doing some bosses because they're getting hit a little bit too hard. Um, so maybe if we refresh the portal, hopefully this will fix it. Okay, cool. Brutus is fixed. Nice. Um, wait. Wait, he has to make it to her, right? Do I have to take another portal? No? Move? Wait, he's glitched. He's desynced. Brutus is desynced. He's actually standing here. Look, 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 look. If I throw this here, this one goes off. What? Yeah, look, if I target him, it throws it. Oh! I do not know what the fuck just happened, but hey, Shav, how you doing? Okay, so she's over here. Will she land right there or no? I hope she lands right there. Feels uh, Shab chunked, man. Is it back to Brutus now? It is back to Brutus, okay. Now we are currently like super squishy, which is part of the reason why I said I really want to use a Cloak of Defiance. Oh, feels crit, man.
Now the reason why we're going crit with this build is we want to try to make sure we can scale enough damage with Bear Trap so that it does get a significant initial hit, which allows us to root like kind of like T15 bosses, because I think rooting targets is very good defensively. Um, obviously it doesn't help us with map clear, but that's what we want the ignite for, which is the new Zoff's not new, but the Zoff's nurture bow spreads like a like an ignite, like like that, hopefully. Um, and if you have like a really sick ignite, it'll just fucking destroy and kill everything. If we have to go like perfect agony, I can. I really do not want to use this node. I really do not like the node. Uh, but just to show you guys a little bit of how the build currently plays. Uh, it's really cool for essence mobs. I'll show you guys why. You just throw a one, two, three, and then you can throw four for good luck if you want. You say hello essence mob, you pick up the essence loot, and you just move on, dude. I think there's Aberath over here too, but Aberath, Aberath might be like kind of sketchy, but uh, that's what makes it fun, right? I don't think I've died in a YouTube video in a long time. Maybe we can go die. Is this Aberath? Valley of the Viadringer? Feels good, man. Okay. Does he jump down? He does, right? Ow! Crit. Oh, he takes, like, crazy reduced damage in this form, doesn't he? When he's, like, doing his stomp stomp. Okay, he jumped. Wait, what? Dude, his AI is so confusing, man. As you can see, we still have like quite a few things to work out with the build, like deeps and stuff. Hopefully this gets uh, adjusted as we get higher level, but you never really know with trap builds these days. <laughs> can I just like one, two, three? I do not want to stand here though. Is he doing a stompy stomp? He's doing a stompy stomp! See, it's not so bad. It just sucks when they spawn in like a really weird way. What are you doing? Cool. So that's pretty much the character in terms of clearing right now. Um, I don't really have anything too special. And like I said, a lot of the damage does come when we get like our 100% fire conversion. Right now we're still split between fire and lightning. Um, which is not really bad, but the pure fire conversion helps because then you can scale penetration a lot easier. Anyway, that's pretty much about it. I hope you guys had a wonderful time. Hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. Uh, the build will take off quite a bit more once we get Deadly Infusion because that'll give us base critical strike chance to our bear trap, which will make it much easier to scale. But for now, like I said, I'm out. Hope you guys had a wonderful time, and I'll see you boys all tomorrow. Remember though, if you did like the stream, or the, sorry, the video, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. I don't know if I said this already. And remember you can catch me streaming live every day at twitch.tv slash pox. Hope you guys have a wonderful time, and I'll see you boys all tomorrow.